Good afternoon, fellow fantasy enthusiasts. Today we have a magical guest speaker. Growing up with a passion for reading and an eagerness to write, Joanne wrote her first book at six and her first novel at 11. While she was in college, she read outside the realm of her course study, laying the foundation for her most famous works. One day on a delayed train, she conceived the idea for what I believe to be one of the best series of novels ever written. Over the next five years, she mapped out the storyline in longhand on scraps of paper. She moved to Portugal to teach English, married, and had a daughter. In 1993, she moved back to England with her daughter and a suitcase containing the first three chapters of book one. Upon completion of that manuscript, she sent samples to several literary agents. One wanted to see the rest. In 1997, that book was published. At the request of the publisher who thought, young boys may not want to read books by female authors, her official literary name, J.K. Rowling, was born. That book was published in the United States in 1998 under an altered title. Six more novels would come over the next nine years. In 2001, the first movie was released and would leave us agonizing until the end in 2011. We were blessed by add-on films in 2016 and 2018 and impatiently await the arrival of the next in 2021. In 2012, she launched her website and published her first adult novel. She also writes crime novels under the pseudonym Robert Galbraith. In 2016, along with the help of some playwrights, Harry Potter and the Cursed Child released, and it would open on Broadway in 2018. Now, I don't know about you, but I mourned the death of Sirius. I sobbed at the losses of Dumbledore and Dobby, but my true sadness came when we lost Snape. Upon my finishing the Deathly Hallows book, I was left with an emptiness as if a loved one had passed. And it was at that time I realized I had been in a relationship with the wizarding world for eight years and had just read the best books I had ever read in my life. Please help me welcome J.K. Rowling. <laughs>